the uh, foil glue that I used is from Born Pretty Store. This is really, really, really old, like maybe two, three years old, but I will be putting a link in for that. And the foil that I used is just some cheapy eBay foil. I had close to um, 50 different foils and I've only got like 10 left. So um, yeah, I've just ordered a whole heap more and I will be putting links to this one here, which is the one that I did a quick mani with whoops, yesterday you can see that so what I'm going to do is just quickly I've just quickly roughly painted my nails nothing fancy what's on my nails is this essence all that gray in the color back to black which is that matte color there and the pink is you're making me crazy and it's like a hot fuchsia pink not a color I would normally wear but yeah I just wanted to step outside my comfort zone I'm going to zoom it in a little so I can show you. Okay, all I do is get this um, foil glue and paint a layer on. So that's what I'm doing. Oh no, I think the cuticle oil got on my nail. I have... I maybe kind of have painted my nails like 30 times in the last two days just testing out stuff so that's why my nails look really manky around the sides and stained up and ugly looking and that's why I had to put some cuticle oil on so that's all I've done is put a layer of this foil glue now I am by no means a pro at this, this is like the second, third time, third time I've used this foil. I am not too fancy with the full coverage foils, I can't seem to get those to work. And this abalone foil that I've got here, I am shocking at using, it's a whole different kind of foil altogether. But I do like these um, ones with the, on the clear backing, it seems to just work a lot better with me. So yeah, that's what I've seemed to have ordered more of, is the one on the clear backing. And all you do is you paint it on milky and it starts drying. Sorry, so it, when it, you paint it on, it's like that. And then it starts drying down like this. And you wait for all the milky color to go, to, to go clear. And then all you do is get your foil once that happens and you um, press it in. So I'm going to pause it and I'll come back when it is completely dry. Well, clear. <laughs> Okie dokie, let's zoom in a little bit closer. Now it is fully clear and I don't know which way this foil goes. It's the only thing I haven't quite worked out yet. So I'm just going to try it this way and if it's the wrong way we will turn it over. And all I do is grab a cotton swab and rub it now i'm going to check to see if i've got it the right way and yes it is i'm going to get a brush just to get it in the corners no that's not going to work i did have a rubber tool on my desk which my friend is using my friend kelly is here so we have to go and pick my son up from work shortly so what I have to do, she's going to go home, but um, that's what we're just doing, and then we're going to remove it. And as you can see, if I put it in the right place, it show you on this nail here. I'm going to put the revolution on it. going to let it dry and this stuff dries really fast as well I'm talking like 30 seconds fast so I'm gonna pause it and I will come back when this is dry right we it is dry 30 seconds is basically how long it took and I am putting a double coat of revolution so I put another layer because I top coat with sesh Vite. And it doesn't wrinkle with two layers on it. And 
that's what we've got so far and as you can see it is not wrinkled at all so I'm going to pause it and I'll come back right now we are dry we are going to put a top coat of sesh feet and then I will show you that it doesn't crinkle right that's our layer of shesh feet and if it didn't have the revolution on there it would crinkle straight away but as you can see sorry guys i'm out of frame as you can see um it didn't crinkle at all um so yeah that was my quick well not so quick but quick um tutorial requested um i am so sorry i have still been mia at the moment i am on my son's phone um my edge has gone back to samsung again so yeah that's why i have been struggling to get videos done and stuff like that because the phone that they gave me is a loan phone is like a hundred years old it's like a htc wildfire or desire or something like that and it's like that big i mean it's like tiny it's like quarter of the size of my edge or about half actually so yeah that's why i've been struggling but anyway guys i hope you enjoyed that and please keep an eye out i will be doing a haul of foils i'm going to get some foils of dixie plates as well she does a whole heap of foils and hers are only a dollar so you can't go wrong with that anyway guys i hope you enjoy that i hope you love this revolution i will put putting links to everything if i can find it um and i'm just going to put links to the new foil stores that i'm using now so anyway guys i hope you enjoy that and i'll see you in the next one bye guys